Hey guys, morning. Beautiful, a stunning morning here in Rome this morning. We're on our second day of our trip. So we're going to go and get a bit of brekkie in Rome before it gets too busy. Uh, then we're going to head down to the beach and we're going to do the Rome to Beachport coastal run. So you go through like Nora Carina and all those beautiful areas. We'll come out of Naracourt. I think we'll do the Naracourt caves this afternoon and spend the night in Naracourt and we'll go on from there. It's, uh, so yeah, it's absolutely packed in Rome this time of year. Um, not many places actually vacant. So you've got to get in early for breakfast. There's probably only two two main places you can get brekkie. So you've got to yeah. Get so we're gonna try to check out this place. It's called Adventure Spoon. This looks like a nice spot sitting outside. Yeah. Busy now. Just thinking what to eat, guys. Might get this much avo. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Spoon. We just ordered breakfast. Chris got um, is it a Nutella uh, latte? Hazelnut, something, hazelnut chocolate latte. The hazelnut Nutella latte. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, big breakfast, and Ruby got the healthy option. We'll Smash share a bit. Avocado, and I'm gonna have some of his bacon. <laughs> <laughs> and then, um, yeah, and head then off after that. Mm -hmm. And we can't wait to show you the beach drive thingy mm -hmm. that Chris likes to do so i'm just tagging first, along first time for me doing this this is the road beach port but a lot of guys from work they've uh, they've spoken about it and um, i've looked a lot of videos on youtube so i've had a bit of a look at where to stop and things like that mm. might put the drone out get some footage yep. so, mm. so hazelnut nutella latte mm -hmm. yum yum and i got this um berry smoothie Healthy, healthy. Avocado and ooh, that's a big brekkie baby. Big brekkie. I'm sure yeah. that one. Take Breakfast done. Oh, look at that. That's cute. That coffee collection, man. Mm. Coffee. So this is the main street What's at that? 10 a.m. You could do that too, yeah. Really? It's this, huh? Look. Uh, okay, yeah. have the visitor center here guys so if you have any questions just visit robe visitor center yeah it's just been bringing everyone in stock for a couple of years now so we don't go there come back up this is the beach guys on the beaches. Um, swimming platform there and there's people doing what's that honey paddle boarding paddle boarding yeah, yeah. there's a lot of dogs as well that's nice so where are we going today love uh, we're gonna jump down onto the all drive track mm -hmm. do beachport to sorry robe to beachport go to an area called nora carina Mm -hmm. I've never been in Nora Carina. Definitely uh, fished with people that have got houses out that way. Mm -hmm. but, um, pretty keen to check it out. From Beachport, we'll come up onto the main road. We'll go check out Panola, uh, then through to Narra Court, have a look at the Narra Court caves this evening. So, yeah. Okay. What do you call oh, it? Yeah. Lone Bulls? Yeah. So, how do you play it? Yeah. Oh. Can you buy me this necklace? Sure. I don't know if you're going to have the stomach to wear it, but that's all cuttlefish back there, isn't it? Necklace. 
Oh, oh, they have a food land here. Where's the thing? Seen food land. We're just gonna grab some drinks. Some ice and some drinks. Guys, there's a food land here. So you don't have to worry to bring too much food. We just got some ice and some drinks. And a salad for lunch. And muffins! Good job, mate. <laughs> We're doing the awesome thing. Yeah. <laughs> Left at the third, uh, just past the third, I go down this road, yep. turn right there, yep. and then you follow that way. Yeah, oh, sweet. quite make sense of the map, but you make more sense of the map. Well, yeah, <laughs> anyway, that's the crossroad. You can either keep going and go to Stony Rise yep. or turn right and go in there. Awesome. But yeah, we went there yesterday afternoon, beautiful over there. Perfect, mate. You want a bottle of Coke or anything? Or you're no, you're right. Sweet, man. Thanks, Thanks a lot, yeah. mate. Cheers. Yeah. So, Chris is doing something here. We're setting the tyres down for a bit more traction on the beach. I was going to sort of let him down to. 28, mm -hmm. but you know, as you're up, it's not too low, but um, I just saw a local guy then and he said, oh, it's pretty, pretty deep in the beach, pretty boldy, so go down to 20 with this. Especially How this would you know if it's already 20? I'll oh, this gauge here. Oh, it's saying it. Me, so I can, uh, and then 25. Oh, okay. So you're going to do that in every single wheel? Mm. Just for the beach drive, hey? Yep, that's it. It's a track there, so it's really only the width of one car. One way, yeah. So we're going in. Quite small. Road. Oh my, are we gonna fit? Oh my. Just went to check Sick the location. Yeah? Awesome Is it safe to go there? Yeah, it's got only part of it and then it gets boggy, so. Yeah. Go and have a look at the beginning of it. Okay. How are you gonna go back though? Just turn around. Okay. So, where are we exactly? Oh my. Uh, we are. We're 
Put down the rope, man. Rope. Does the water go through here? No, really. Sorry? Water, like beach Not water. Not to this part. Is he also going left? Let him go first. Go first, mate. So you... I'm not going to go all the way. It's pretty boggy. Yeah. But I'm just going to go part of it. Okay. Oh, that's... Just went to check Sick the location. Right yeah? Awesome Is it safe to go there? Yeah, it's got only part of it and then it gets boggy, so. Yeah. Gonna have a look at the beginning of it. Okay. How are you gonna go back though? Just turn around. Yeah, it's just been bringing everyone and stuff for a couple of years now, so we don't go there. Come back up. Okay, Chris. What's the plan? So to drop him to 15, gonna do all of them. And I'll just try and rock myself and out we go. Okay. Hopefully it will work. I just don't want to dig myself in the mm. Oh, we got, there's a guy down there, is he? Uh, much worse predicament. Yeah, he's also stuck. He's really mm. It's lovely beach though, and there's like a cave there. Hmm. What do you say, are we going to survive? I'm just letting the tires down. <laughs> It's heaps of people around here, people swimming there. Yeah, you make sure Those though. Dudes are what, up big what, time. what are the people gonna be doing? They're not gonna be able to help us, they're oh, just they swimming. Won't be able to do anything, but I, I mean, it's not like we're remote. Robe's only just over there. <laughs> it's all good fun. So, you're saying we're stuck? A little bit. Oh! I might have to get my hands and start digging out, save getting the shovel out. I got some max tracks under there, but they're buried all the way down. So, I'm gonna leave you. I'm gonna Drinks call break. The, I'm gonna call your dad. John, can you please? Yeah, I'll be straight down with the Camry. <laughs> they were stuck. <laughs> Just gonna go down and show you what happened. Ooh, you guys, because the sand is so soft. Someone's digging. It's a bit lazy. I can't be stuck getting the shovel out, so I'm just gonna use my hand. Oh. Same with the match tracks. It's all buried under here. Yeah. Uh, I don't want to go forward. I want to rock myself out that way. Head over. Like it's only just settled in. I was a bit greedy with my tire pressures at just uh, over 20, so I've So what's the plan? I've lowered it. Oh, the tires right. You just remember. have to take that off. Okay. At least it's not that hard. You're absolutely stuck. You can always use stuff like that. Mm. Use things to get grip. Someone's stuck as well. Oh, we're gonna try. I mean, Chris is gonna try to move again. Let's see what's gonna happen. Up to us. Fingers crossed, guys. Hi, <laughs> yeah, please, Lord. Come on. Uh oh, it's too soft. What? 
deep one. Some food. <laughs> I think it's I'm some 38s. So next time, the 38 muddies will be going on. Not this cheap shit. <laughs> oh god. What put golf cart tires on a tank? Hey, you know what? You were actually okay when yeah, you were going you there, but you were it. going under the uh, the same. You got a rocket. That's the yeah, not same not hole. If we need to, I'll just dig ourselves out. Okay. 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 Do it again. Do you want me to dig? Hold that hand. Uh, back to it. Ah, lucky your mate lent it to you. I wouldn't have come down here without him anyway. Yeah. Um, yeah. First time I've actually used Max tracks. I used to use a um, set of like checker plate stuff, and that would pull the car. Okay, we'll see what's gonna see happen. What yep, I'm driving. <laughs> okay. To snap them. Are you ready? <laughs> Yep, I will. You need this? Huh. Oh my, it's actually buried. Can't even pull it. Oh, yep, here it is. I can't. Where are you? someone just passed by <laughs> good luck that's the good Samaritan there <laughs> Lucky he passed by. Mm -hmm. Ooh, yes, come on. Ooh. Come on, come on, come on. Yes.
Oh, thank God. God. Oh my God. Thanks for all your help, man. Does it, is that the road out? back into the tyres, we're going to go on the main road now, so I'll lift them up to 35, something like that, 35, 40, so yeah, bit of a learning curve for me, done off-road plenty of times, but not where it's been that soft, so I had my tyres down to about 15, mm -hmm. between 12 and 15, I ended up having to get them right down to about 8, the guy that oh, wow. helped me out told me you need to lower them down more, so that was a good learning experience for me. Okay, um, yeah. sweet.